Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Cross. We got a little bit to do today on a boss fight, but I also want to recruit Mickey really quickly, so let's get on with it. If you come to the dining room of the Zelbis, you get to talk to Mickey, who is in the play, of course. And she seems to know that her gig is over, and her life is over now, too. So we can have her join the party. Alright. And I think she's a blue innate. Oh, red innate. I'm completely correct. Incorrect, rather. But she's got a lot of agility. Wow, good accuracy. Actually, not half bad. Wow. Maybe I'll use her later on. So now I'll meet you guys over at the other worlds. Um, Marble. I have a fight coming up. All right, here we are, the other worlds. Marble, and as this guy has said, the Black Dragon is now awake from his slumber. We killed all the little enemies that had it taken down. I'm going to go ahead and keep using this party. I want Fargo to steal an item from him. A very useful item. And he is a hard fight, so I'll probably, I'll probably skip about five minutes or whatever. That way I can fit the entire fight on this video, but also get about four or five turns into where I can see kind of what my uh, strategy is. And what his strategy is as well. Look at him in all of his glory. Alright, time to kill him. I love this theme. Probably one of the better themes of the game, and that's saying something. I like how he just threatens me right when I walk in. You, you helped me, did you? Well, time to kill you. Alright, anyway. Let's see what we got here. He does have free fall, which you can steal. Everything else is basically based off of him, and he can curse you, which is kind of annoying as well. So start off getting trying to steal the black plate. If you can fail, then you can run away and try again. Hopefully I succeed. Ow! Ow! Holy shit! Pillage. Such a ridiculous name for a steel. Pillage? Yeah, I did get it! Alright! Sweet! Pillage used to, like, I always just think about, like, burning stuff down when I think about pillaging. Let's see, what do we want? Go ahead and use Imbecile. Hopefully that doesn't miss. Nope, it does work. Outstanding. And this can curse you, so be careful with that. Ow! Any curses? No, no curses. That's good. Gotta heal up here in a second. Here we go, cure all. Having a blue innate really comes in handy for your party. Probably more than any other one right now. Other than maybe white. Because you fight so many black innates while you're Lynx that having a white innate is just really useful. Oh, now I'm cursed. Awesome. Don't fail me, boy. Alright, I think I've gotten a good feeling of how to kill him. He's got 3,900 HP, which is quite a lot, so I will be right back. Alright, took him down. Make sure you have a lot of healing items. He does take quite a while, and he does do AoE damage on everybody, and it does hurt. 
but we got our first dragon out of the way. Should get a star for that. We do get a star. Uh, the reason it says 24 out of 30 is because whenever you use a summon, it uses your star power up. And I was using Frog Prince against those Lagoonites. So you can just rest it in and it goes back. It's nothing to worry about. And we get Grim Reaper, which is the ultimate black magic. It works in the same way the Frog Prince did. So that's pretty cool. Ah, oh, I thank you for killing me. I did want to go ahead and do one more thing, and that'll be in Viper Manor, so I want to meet you guys there before I get going with the main part of the quest again. So if we come over here to the Viper Manor, there's a sinkhole now where the basement used to be. We can explore down there a little bit. Let's go ahead and try that. There's a few treasures down here. Nothing important. It's really just kind of for fun. But, uh, it's worth grabbing some stuff. There's some mithril gear. Hey! Hey! Whew! Oh, I miss a treasure. Damn it. There we go. What's down here? I just came here like two videos ago and I'm already out of it. I don't remember where everything is. I'm going to try to find my way around here before I start to get angry and just leave because I did want to get some mithril gear down here and there is a revive down here which is kind of useful I guess okay hurry up you bats god damn it there we go Whoop. there here's something Hey, carapace dress. I don't have any female characters. Ah, that actually might be the best treasure you can get down here, so at least I got that. And of course... There we go, to get back through. Oh god, the bat's escaped! The bat has escaped! Run away! Oh man, oh. There we go, run! Whew! Alright, well, we can come up here, of course. We met Fargo last time. This time, I don't think we'll be meeting anybody. <sighs> Let's try our hand at the middle one, since there's obviously a treasure in there. There we go. Help. Hello. I know it's locked. Can you fucking open the gate? Is this man blind? He sees us... First of all, wouldn't you be a little interested in people coming out of the sewer and all? Oh boy, wow, where the hell... How'd they get there? I might want to go talk to him. Second of all, let me the fuck out. You see General Viper, the guy who owns the manor. Anyways, I'm enough, enough ranting. I'll be outside. I'm going to meet you guys outside. Aha, there we go. Let's go in here. Ah. Someone's already beat me to the dragon. Well, time to go. No, just kidding. Yeah, the Marvel team was great. I just opened that place up now. And I killed the dragon that was terrorizing the city. Uh, there is a rainbow shell here to get. So hopefully I'll be able to show that off in the next video. But I'm just about running out of time. So, we go ahead and jump right in this quicksand. Apparently it's a ladder since we're climbing. <laughs> okay. What are they crazy too? Damn amateurs. Cotton picking. Sons of bitches. No, we are not dead. We're okay. So, let's go on through here. Get a treasure on our way out. Some mithril. Can I come up here? No! No! Ah! Anyways, this seems like a good enough place to stop. I'll be doing the Earth Dragon next time. 
Thank you guys for watching. I'm out.